So sometimes you may decide to empower your dashboard users to decide when to show or hide uh, the labels in their visualizations. And therefore, in this class, I just want to show you how you can uh, do so using a parameter. And for this case, I've just created a very simple view showing the cells for different months. And what I'm going to do first, I'm going to create a parameter. So I'm going to come here, then create parameter. And this parameter, I'm going to rename it show stroke eyed labels. And the data type, I'm going to use a boolean. Not you can also use an integer, uh, a string to do that. And for this case, the current value is true. And I'm going to assign the aliases or the alternative names, which are going to be visible in the dashboard. For this case, I'm going to assign true as on and false as off. So basically when you select on, uh, in this case, you will be displaying the labels. When you select off, you will be hiding the labels. So let me click OK, and I'm going to uh, show this parameter, or rather to make it visible within the view, but at clicking, and then uh, I'm going to show parameter, and as you can see here, the parameter is visible. And now next, what I'm going to do, I'm going to create a simple calculated field. In this calculated field, we can give it a name. So let me just call it again, show uh, stroke hide uh, labels. And the calculation will be very simple. I'm going to say if the parameter show stroke hide labels is true, then I'm going to uh, return the cells. If otherwise, nulls and then I'm going to close my calculation. So basically, uh, when the parameter is true, that is when the selection is on, uh, I will be using these uh, cells uh, to label my view. If otherwise, I'm simply going to use nulls as my labels, meaning for that case, nothing will be visible within the view. So let me click OK. And I'm going to drag this new calculated field to the label. And as you can see, the view is labeled since uh, the current selection on the parameter is on. So the labels are on. If I select off, you're going to see the labels are, are going to be turned off. And basically that is a simple feature that you can use to uh, empower users to decide when to have the labels visible or uh, hidden. And that's all. Thanks everyone.